I suffered a lot because my children would get sick very often. I began to watch the testimonies on television. I decided to go to the Grace of God Church. This was more than 10 years ago. I became a sponsor of the ministry and I give my tithes and offerings. I was in need of a job, right? She came. And then we began to work together right away when we had a serious problem. I was suspicious of her and I thought that she had taken some food away for her children. I told her, are you suspicious of me? Thank God my husband works so I don't have this need to steal things from people and take them home. But actually nothing had happened. I think that what it was was something my mind made up, you know? This caused a very serious problem. She was very hurt inside of her heart, and I noticed that she hated me very much. Her family also wanted to and sue me. And it was me. all about food, you know, so I told her, you are very stingy, and then the fights began. Sometimes it felt like she was stepping on me, something like, there is no more toilet paper. Oh, well, I should have brought some from my home. I was very hurt. I would bring food from home to eat. I used to provoke her very much. She would say, Eliane, you can't iron the clothes this way. You need to place a towel over the ironing board. It was enough for us to fight. She always had a lot of sorrow in her heart. It seemed that God was already working because despite all that, I still kept working there. I didn't give up. She took good care of my children, and this was very important. I saw an opportunity to evangelize, to save her. I asked her for her forgiveness. I said, I'm sorry if I hurt you. Let's see how we could forgive like God forgives us in the Bible. I started teaching her God's word, and she started believing. Yes, she's a godly woman. I began to listen to the preaching of the word on television. She had several problems. There were a lot of health issues. Her daughter was always being hospitalized. So with this, we began to get closer and unite. We listened and watched the faith show together. We always had our Bibles open. As soon as she arrived, I opened my Bible and we read the word together. And we started to talk more. She would read the Bible and teach me more, although I still had that hatred in me, I still stopped and listened to the word. She began to learn and her health improved. She was healed. All of her issues, you know. I insisted. I never gave up. When she made the decision, I said, you have to stand firm in the word. You have to abide in Jesus. She decided to follow Jesus and she decided to get baptized in the waters, to stand with God, to obey the word and sanctify her life. Then she was able to forgive me. And because of that, our relationship got better and better. So I began to stand firm before the Lord God. And thanks to God, I was set free. Eliane is my friend. She is my right hand. She helps me so much. There is no one else that does for me what she does. She takes care of my children as if they were hers. I forgave her. I learned to love her very much. A new birth in Jesus Christ. It was a beautiful work that God did in our life. Oh, I love her with all my heart. She's so much more than everything to me because she was the one who taught me the word of the Lord God. Jesus is a... Jesus is a blessing in my life because only He was able to transform my life. The two of us together could have been a curse, but God transformed our relationship into a blessing. It's all over now. It's all in the past. Oh, Jesus, you sure know how to turn around these situations. 